Hello and welcome. Oh, I was searching for something and I noticed that uh, this question was just so simple. What's the phone number for the blind girl with the blue eye with the green eyes that pick up the bus with me yesterday? And you see, Google know nothing about that. Um, look, no result at all. While if we go here and say we need like Paul, Paul, what's this? It's all Paul, <laughs> yeah, the ball. And if we say go, see thousands, thousands of results. So Google's going worse and worse in the field of uh, search engines. Anyways, now <laughs> let's continue. Uh, we uh, we uh, discuss uh, uh, the importance of uh, aliases, and we make some aliases, uh, random aliases. And now we will move uh, to the. Uh, we will just configure just a simple NAT rule. So. This uh, simple NAT rule for let's say we have web server and uh, enable or disable it's okay don't disable it interface it's in the one protocol TCP source anything destination what's the destination it will be the one address destination port uh, like HTTP or if you uh, other like uh, 8080 or uh, 8090 or anything but it's by default web server on 8080 what's the IP address will be re redirected to you will go here to uh, aliases and you will say we will add a new alias which is web servers and you will say web servers or web server for uh, let's say finance and this is host uh, and this IP fully qualified to domain name Let's say it's in the LAN of DMZ, so it will 92168.58. Uh, I don't know. Dot, let's say dot 200. And this will be something like this. And you will save. Apply changes. And you will move here. And now, let's say web. Oh, wireless okay let's refresh this page and we will go here and we'll choose destination well this is HTTP and redirect we will say web web servers and what's the target will be maybe we will HTTP and then we will start picking up uh, new uh, new uh, ports like the first port will be 8080 the second port will be 81 82 and we can move uh, for large number of, of web servers uh, also we can redirect from the web like if we catch uh, things uh, this is uh, a lot of uh, complicity right now but uh, I would say you can add now say a web server for finance and uh, so if we provide others so we will should or we should provide this or you can see we have web web uh, configurator oh web configurator okay not not this but we also we can provide alias for the uh, web server for finance port 
and we will apply so and we will save this and we will apply now we will move to the uh, rules rules uh, now for the LAN everything easy and smooth because this is the operation center and uh, we can, we should reach everything from here but nothing should reach us else from uh, from our uh, under our permissions and uh, with high security because everything here is nice and uh, smooth uh, so when we move to the DMZ first thing you should uh, you should uh, add uh, is deny or block a block from DMZ interface IP address protocol TCP or any uh, yeah, let's say any anything source any destination you can say to the firewall uh, will be denied so we will deny anything in the interface DMZ IP version 4 or both to protocol anything to the source anything from any source from any IP address or from local uh, network now uh, to destination which is our firewall everything will be dropped you can lock the packets and you say uh, drop all packets to the firewall I say save and apply this first one the second one will be uh, to add another entry for your uh, for your local so source any uh, any uh, any protocol any source to destination which is local net yeah local net which includes the local uh, LAN address so we don't need anybody to reach our local net because our operation center will be there so drop all packets sorry packets head to LAN net okay and save hmm what is this oh, let's make it block and save last thing you should add your uh, of course you will apply all of them uh, after uh, all of them at once because you shouldn't reload uh, your firewall uh, for every uh, single rule you add so now you will pass do you need to uh, block anything like any IP address any host any domain anything now we will pass uh, from this is interface this is IP any protocol from source uh, not specified to destination any uh, allow all packets and we will save and we will apply them all of them now we should go now and we should see if let's say repair and see yeah everything fine with with our configuration now let's say let's start session and this is the default page for uh, for the windows but now 
uh, let's see we will ping ping uh, what the local LAN uh, host which is 254 yeah we can we can reach it but uh, uh, let's see what we will do okay okay we'll go to the web configurator and we should say this 192.57.2 uh, sorry 168.57.254 what the heck is that um, we have something wrong Mm, okay, okay, okay. TMC from home to port packets, source, port, destination, none. Hey, what what I miss hmm. so we will drop all packet to the land we will drop all packet to the firewall we will uh, destination firewall this firewall I think we missing something mm, protocol any source anything destination oops source what's the source of this packet so the source will be the LAN, the DMZ net and the destination will be the firewall and we should save this and we will change the other one before we uh, edit and we will be source DMZ net save and apply changes and close now we will what is that okay let's say admin one two three one two three oh that's bad that's bad that's bad okay for now just uh, <laughs> see what happened and uh, we will uh, fix this later uh, for now thanks for your listening have a nice time